Outlander Season 4, Release Date, Cast, Trailer and Everything You Need to Know. The hashtag Droughtlander is almost over. Outlander has proved such a success for stars that the network has already renewed the show for a fifth and sixth season. But before we get to those, we've got season four of the historical time travel romance to look forward to, which will be based on the fourth book in Diana Gabaldon's series, Drums of Autumn. After the season three finale saw our time-crossed lovers wash up in America after a shipwreck, but that's not the only thing we know about season 4, so here's everything else about it, saving you the need to travel in time to find out what happens. Outlander season 4 release date, when's it coming? Stars has confirmed that season 4 will premiere in November 2018, slightly later than the September launch for season 3, but we don't have an exact date for you just yet. In the UK. The show airs on Amazon Prime Video and it's likely the show will continue to be available close to its US air date, usually the next day, although it's unclear whether it'll be part of Amazon's new Stars Play channel. Outlander Season 4 cast, who's coming back and who's joining? Of course, Katrina Balfe and Sam Hewen will be back as the time-crossed lovers Claire and Jamie, as otherwise there wouldn't be much of a show. We'll also be seeing Sophie Skelton back as their daughter Brianna who will time travel in season 4, only not like her mother did. The path that she takes to make the journey is very different than the path that Claire took, executive producer Ronald D. Moore teased. She goes for a different purpose, and in a different way than Claire did. Other returning stars include John Belazzi and Fraser Murray, Richard Rankin as Roger Wakefield, Lauren Lyle as Marsley McKimmy Fraser and Caesar Domoy as Fergus Fraser. They'll be joined by a host of new faces including its Beliers as the villainous pirate and smuggler Stephen Bonnet. It's hard to top Blackjack but we have with Bonnet. Ed's Beliers committed to this. People are going to hate him, Hewen told The Hollywood Reporter. Fortunately, Jamie will have his Aunt Joe Casta to rely on played by orphan black star Maria Doyle Kennedy. She sounds and looks like his mother, Huen explained. Jamie really is a family man so for him this is a huge moment, but she's a Mackenzie and the Mackenzies are notoriously big players in politics so that definitely comes up. Other newcomers to season 4 include Lord of the Rings star Billy Boyd as wealthy lawyer Gerald Forbes, who is friends with Joe Casta, Caitlin O'Rion as Lizzie who goes on a big adventure with Brianna. Simona Brown as Brianna's best friend Gail, Natalie Simpson as Joe Casta's personal maid and seamstress Phaedra and Tim Downey as Governor William Tyron, a real-life historical figure. And if you think you've definitely seen the last of Tobias Menzies as Frank Randall and Black Jack Randall after their deaths in Season 3, think again. You won't really be seeing Black Jack again this season but there's a chance you might see Frank again. It'll be interesting to see your reaction to how we play him, if we get to do it, how we play him this season, because it's a slightly different flavor, Moore explained. Executive producer Meryl Davis added, It's hard because obviously Frank is dead. But you know what, certainly in the book anyway, we always see flashbacks of Claire's relationship with Frank. We love that. But the most important addition to Season 4 is obviously these adorable puppies as Roll of the Dog. Outlander Season 4 trailer, when can we expect new footage? While we might still be waiting for a full Season 4 trailer, stars have been kind enough to release this, brief, teaser. So that's all you've got so far. Stars released the full trailer for Season 3 in July 2017, a couple of months before the season premiered. So if they do the same for Season 4, we can expect it sometime in September. Outlander Season 4 Spoilers, what's it going to be about? There's no official synopsis for Season 4 yet, but we can take some hints from the book it's based on, Drums of Autumn. You can read the full synopsis on Gabaldon's official site, but here's a teaser. Claire and Jamie, with Jamie's nephew young Ian, seek to find a place for themselves in the colony of North Carolina treading a dangerous line between Governor Tryon's patronage and Claire's knowledge of the brewing revolution in America. Between the help of Jamie's Aunt Joe Casta, last of his Mackenzie kin and the unwanted obligations of her slave-run plantation. As they find mountain land and begin to build their first cabin, their newfound life is bittersweet, with the thought Brianna, the daughter Claire has left behind, the daughter Jamie will never see, always near. Brianna is thinking of her parents 
too. And she's discovered something dangerous in the historical record, a notice of a fatal fire on Fraser's Ridge. The time traveler's ultimate dilemma raises its head once again. Can the past be changed? If it can dot what's the price? As to whether we can expect season 4 to follow closely to the book it's based on, Moore told Deadline that the show will continue to figure out what works best from the book for the season. There, are, departures from the book, and we embroidered certain storylines in different ways. We've probably resequenced the order of certain events in that book, changed some storylines here and there, he hinted. I wouldn't say it's anything radical. You know, I think readers of the book who still love the book will definitely recognize the story and the characters, and the general shape of the season is definitely the shape of the book as well. One thing's for sure though, it will feature the book's notable sequence that sees Jamie earn the nickname Bear Killer. We have a specific spin on that whole thing. So I'm interested to see how people react, more teased, with Hugh and adding that there are going to be some surprises there for fans of the books.